Hi guys, we're looking at plate tectonics today. These are all the different plate tectonics, the plate margins that are all around the world, okay? They're all different sizes. They're like jigsaw pieces coming together. This is another way to look at it. Most of our volcanic and earthquake activity happens around these margins. Look at all those red dots, especially Ring of Fire Pacific Ocean. We've got three different types of plate margins, constructive, destructive, and conservative. In a constructive plate margin, two pieces of crust move apart from each other, normally oceanic crust. They move apart, what rises from underneath is magma, heated up, okay? That rises, it cools, it forms a new land. We've got the Mid-Atlantic Ridge in Iceland as an example. Destructive plate margin, uh, the denser oceanic crust subducts, get a subduction dome underneath the lighter continental crust, okay? Get volcanoes rising up, fold mountains. An example is the Andes Mountains in South America. Last one, conservative plate margin, two plates, normally continental margins, moving alongside each other, rubbing, causing some friction. Eventually that'll snag soon enough though, okay, that friction builds up over time, boom, get a massive earthquake. An example of this one, San Andreas Fault in California.